Hey everyone, today we'll demonstrate how to upgrade the storage and memory in MSI Katana 15 B13 series. This video also applies to Pulse, Sword, Crosshair 15 and Creator M16 series laptops. Let's start by preparing the following tools to make the process easier and safer during the upgrade. A plastic praying tool, a Philip number one head screwdriver, and an anti-static wrist strap or gloves. For the SSD and memory, you will need to get the correct specification to get the best compatibility experience. MSI Katana 15 B13 provides up to two DDR5 5200 slots and supports up to 64 gigabytes of memory. It also provides two slots of M.2 SSD, which are NVMe PCIe Gen 4. Before you begin pulling everything apart, Please make sure that your Katana 15 B13 is turned off and the adapter connector to the laptop is removed. Then press power button over 25 seconds to cut off battery power. The laptop will not turn on unless you connect the adapter back. Remember to take note on all of the screws and which hole it is removed from, as they are slightly different. We suggest you to grab a piece of paper and put it next to the laptop. When you remove each screw, just place it on the corresponding spot where you remove it on the paper. That way, you can keep track on where it goes. Using the screwdriver, unscrew the back cover of the laptop, which has a total of 13 screws. After removing all the screws, use the plastic print tool to lift the bottom cover from the top side and lift the bottom cover from the right side to detach the hook. Then gently pray it open the case from the right to left side. Remove screws on the battery. Disconnect battery cable, then remove the battery. For the SSD slots, the Pulse 15 series has only one slot for the M.2 NVMe PCIe Gen 4 SSD. Now, to upgrade the SSD, here is how you do it. Remove the screw. Remove the onboard SSD. Insert the upgraded SSD into the SSD slot with a mid angle. Secure the screw back into place. If you want to upgrade the RAM, here is how you do it. Press the slot hook with both hands and then remove the memory. Insert the new memory into the memory slot with a mid angle. Just reverse the process of dismantling the back cover and motherboard to resemble it. Make sure that all the screws and cables return to their original positions. Let's boot up the system to ensure that the upgrades were successful. Connect the laptop to AC power, press the power button and repeatedly hit the delete key to enter BIOS. Select storage information to view information of the newly installed SSD. Hit the escape key to return to the main page. Now, select system information to view information on the newly installed memory. That's how to upgrade the storage and memory on the MSI Katana 15 B13. There are quite some process to go through, but hopefully you know it.